song but yesterday Flew me to a place not far away She's a pretty pilot in my mind Singing songs of love to pass the time Gonna write a song so she can see Give her all the love she gives to me Talk of better days that have yet to come Never felt this love from anyone She's not anyone She's not anyone She's not anyone Songbird by Oasis has to be one of the easiest Oasis songs that we can play on guitar. Written by Liam Gallagher and probably with the only couple of chords that he knew basically at the time of writing it. But we have the G major chord, which Liam played in this fashion. And then we have the E minor 7 chord, which is an E minor chord, but keeping the third and little finger where they were on the G. What we also have as an optional extra, beginners don't have to do this if you're a total beginner because you could just play this as a two chord song, but we're also going to cover how we change between these with what we call a slash chord, which in this case is a G slash F sharp, which means we're playing a G chord, but we've got an F sharp note in the lower register in the bass. And that is used as kind of a passing chord between the G and the E minor. And every time, we go between those two chords, we put the F sharp in between them. The main strumming pattern that we want to use is down, 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 up, down, up, and that is for one bar in this fashion. And we essentially play the G chord for four bars and the E minor chord for four bars. And just for the last two beats, we strum the passing chord or slash chord of the G slash F sharp in this fashion. And I'll count the bars as we go. One, two, three, four. One. Bar two. Bar three. Bar four. If that's too difficult for you, you can just strum four bars of the G major chord and four bars of the E minor 7, that's totally fine. And um, if your little fingers are really hurting from keeping them down all the time, you could just strum the G chord and then just the normal E minor chord. Those can be steps that people need to go through to build up the calluses and build up the strength in the little fingers to keep them under control. But the concept is, if possible, we have this passing chord when we go between those chords. So let's get a repetition of that going nice and slow, play along to me, and then that will basically be the whole song. No, nothing else happens in this song. Really simple, really cool song, only a couple of minutes long. And if you can join into me, then I recommend you play along to the Oasis music video to try and play along with Liam singing because he's a far better singer than me. So ready on the G chord, in, one, two, three, and four, and one, two, three, four, two. And we change three and four and one, two, three, four, two, three, Not far. 
this love from anyone Now if the strumming get very slightly It's totally fine So I just keep strumming downs and ups It's totally fine We'll finish on the G Because no doubt, even just from playing that That was about just a little over, over a minute You'll probably have big lines in your fingers And guess what? I do too. It is totally normal, but the idea is it just doesn't hurt once you've been playing guitar consistently for at least kind of a couple of weeks or two or three weeks. Uh, as long as you don't let it be, don't play for too long at once and don't go too long without playing. So don't leave it more than a, a day or two between playing because then your calluses kind of disappear. That's what we're doing. So hopefully that was something that you could do. If that's something you can do, then you are done. You should try and play along to the uh, Oasis music video or any live versions that you find and try and keep going for the whole song. If that's something that you can't do, let's go for the easier option of going for a G just to E minor. And this is just for the beginners out there that are still struggling with keeping going with the strumming hand and chord changes. So we're gonna do four bars and then four bars of E minor. And you'll hear how similar it is. Join in with me, same strumming pattern if you can, in one, two, three, and four, and one, two, three, four, E minor, one, two, three, four, back to G. on the G. One, two, three, four, G. Let's do that one more time and I'll be singing the verses at this point. Uh, join in with me, if you can, from the G chord in one, two, three, and four, and Talking to a songbird yesterday Flew me to a place not far away She's a pretty pilot in Hopefully that was something that you could do, if not, a couple more days of practicing the G and E minor change and perhaps this change will enable you to do it. To play along to the original, there's an extra two bars of the G right at the start and that's all you need to be able to play along to the original music video or original recording. Hope you really enjoyed that. Guys, you can check out more easy beginner songs on my Andy Guitar YouTube channel, the Andy Guitar website, and the Andy Guitar app. I hope to see you in one of those places, and if so, I will see you there. Bye-bye for now.